show up down there. <laughs> you will get food when I feed you. <laughs> and not a moment before. Anyways. When we last left off, Zale was tasked to become a delivery boy. That seems to happen a lot in these types of games. An alcohol delivery boy. <laughs> Look at the glorious, un bleh, glorious non-existent anti-aliasing. Yeah. <laughs> Look at those edges. Look how they ripple. Mom, fireworks, fire! What is with what is with British pronunciations and referring to mom as mum? I guess that was nothing. I heard a voice coming. I heard a voice coming from the cart over there just now. It's got to be a ghost. Oh, right. I almost forgot about something. I'll, I'll head out back over to the tavern. I, I almost completely neglected this. There won't be any subtitles for this, so you'll have to listen carefully, but this is like a this is like a hidden thing that you only have a limited time to uh listen to. And this is the first time it's available. Huh. So Brad! Doesn't hold a candle to mine, of course. Ridiculous. As if this is some real victory to be proud of. You're being awfully quiet, Yuri. What? No! Wait. What? Oh, uh, nothing. Anyway, I'm getting out now. It's as big as a baroque. Yep, he's got a baroque. <laughs> now the damn thing isn't working anymore. What? I honestly think your batteries are going up in that remote. Yeah. Uh, it needs new batteries. Because it's never been that unresponsive before. And sometimes it'll start to respond, and then it'll be like, no. You know, I, co I completely forgot that the Wii U could be used as a TV remote. Oh, yeah. That was an interesting feature. Anyways. Oh, hey. You're one of old Kentis's new customers, right? What's up? Kentis? Yeah, the owner of that tavern where you folks are staying. So how can I help you? The tavern seems to be fresh out of drink. And you came all the way out here to get some more. You mercenaries must really love your drink, eh? Here you go. They should do, yeah. No need for cash. I'll sort that out with Kentis some other day. Fine liquor. <laughs> you can actually do this part without ever having talked to him. Huh. Because what you have to do is investigate where that sneeze came through. Yeah, I feel like this should be on its own separate chapter from what I did last episode. Yeah. Uh, what are you doing inside this thing? Don't worry. I'm not going to hurt you. You there, mercenary. Uh. You haven't seen a girl around here, have you? Around the same age as yourself? No. You're quite sure? Yes. My shoulder is clipping through my coat. Looks like she's not round here after all. Yeah. Honestly, if the boss finds out about this, we're gonna be in real trouble. Yeah. Are they... looking for you? Don't worry. <laughs> They're gone now. You can come out. I'm clearly not the girl on the clock, sorry. <laughs> Thank goodness. I 
couldn't stand it in there, but it was hard to tell whether it was safe to leave. But why are you hiding? Mm, well, um... It's all right if you don't want to say. I won't cry. I'm Zael, by the way. My name's Lisa, and thank you. You're an awfully nice person. I'm totally not trying to hide my real name. Oh, no. My name is P. Tear. I really can't afford to be caught. Can you help? Griffin. <laughs> All right. Follow me. Damn it! <laughs> Honestly, don't those people ever give up? That should have been voiced. It's complicated. Huh? You shouldn't pry into a maiden's personal business. <laughs> Sorry then. My mistake. Oh yeah, the fireworks! Oh, I've loved them since I was a little girl. Pity there's no time to stop and watch. No, this is perfect. With all these people around, we might be able to lose them. Oh right, then let's head for the market. Those are actually some pretty good fireworks. Yeah, Zale had a line that wasn't voiced. It, it came up in the subtitle says, why are they chasing you? Everything before and after that has been voiced. Hurry up, Lisa. Hold on, Zale. You should be more considerate of a young lady. Hello. We should be more considerate of the Let's Players. What a wonderful smell! It looks so tasty! <laughs> You're quite the charmer, little lady! You want one, then? Oh, really? <gasps> Thank you so much! So, um, how do you eat this? Huh? Huh? What?! Uh, um... Well, that was weird. These look lovely. I'll take this one. Hey, let's see some cash. Hmm? Cash? Do you mean money? Excuse me? Jasmine, is that you? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, this is very similar to the Here, will this do? I'm very sorry. It's just, I didn't realize that I needed money. Whoops. Don't tell me you've never been to a market before. I haven't. That's why I really wanted to come. Clap my hands, clap my hands, get over to my stall. The secret of successful business is good judgment of an eye for quality. That's why I've traveled the seven seas in search for the very best quality. If you're ever on a ship, make sure and keep an eye out for merchants. Merchants on board ships always have interesting things to say or something. <sighs> Okay, where is it? I don't want to poke my nose into your business, but I'm guessing you've run away from home, right? Hmm? Yes. Are you angry? No, I'm actually quite enjoying this. I've never met anyone like you before. You're making fun of me now, aren't you? Hmm. No. I honestly mean it. What's this now? Some kind of trouble? Let's go and see! Huh? Lisa! Wait up! Sounds like somebody's starting a fight over in Fountain Plaza. Can you imagine? Gotta go see the fight! Those good-for-nothing soldiers are causing trouble again. Honestly. Honestly? Honestly? All right then. Uh, it, it's, it's on the house. Uh, take it. <laughs> we'll be back. And you better have some decent grub next time. Stupid guards. People are trying to make an honest living. They think they can take everything for free just because they have a little status.
got a problem, girlie. Don't you people have any money? I was under the impression that guards received a proper wage. <laughs> you should pay for what you eat. What was that? Let's hear you say that again. I see you're looking for a proper telling off. Now listen. If you're buying something, huh? you have to pay for it with money. <laughs> the seller needs that money to keep his wares fully stocked. Where would we be without rules like these? It would be chaos. <laughs> so, now that you understand, I suggest you pay up. That's right. You tell him, lass. <laughs> you had better mind your manners. <laughs> Look at the balls on this guy, girl. <clears throat> oh, my hand. That felt good. You want some as well? Believe me, I won't hold back. Zale! You better run for it. The arena. I guess we shouldn't push our luck. Come on, Lisa, let's run for it! Wow, that's what I said. New tutorial! <laughs> Lazarus City Chase! Lisa or Zale's HP will decrease if either is caught. The game is over when HP reaches zero. If Zale is caught by a guard, shake. L stick to escape. Uh, I'll sh the L stick from left to right to escape. Press R to look behind you. Other people, fruit, street, corners, etc., will be useful in making you get away. Hold it! We should focus on trying to get away from these soldiers. Yes. I'm sorry about back there. No problem. You did a fine thing. Oh, oh no! Watching those people act like that. I just couldn't restrain myself. Besides, Lisa, I'm amazed you could lecture them right after you tried to pull the same thing. You're coming with us! I don't think so. Ah, where did they go? Oh no, they can't have gone far. Keep looking. Hold it. You're coming with us. What the fuck? What the hell? One step. <laughs> Get off a of hoya! You can knock things over to give yourself an advantage, but only if you give them the fuck. One step out of the sword. I steal only what I can't afford. That's everything. <laughs> very, very Aladdin. <laughs> I like that they showed her without her cloak in the tutorial. That was kind of weird. <laughs> no. Take that. Hold it. Take that. Objection. Objective. Ah, where did they go? This is quite a chase. They can't have gone far. Keep looking. Ah, where did they go? They can't have gone far. Keep looking. I think we lost them. Phew. Thank goodness. This Lisa was a curious young woman indeed. With each passing moment, Zale felt ever more enchanted by her charming smile and innocent heart. I can't believe it. Is this really your first time out here in the city? Yes, that's why I'm having so much fun. Well, as long as you're happy. By the way, Zale, what do you do for a living? Me? If I tell her I'm a mercenary, it'll just scare her off. Actually, don't tell me. I'll guess. Hmm, I know. You're a traveling merchant. You seem like someone who's been to all kinds of different places. And how many jobs allow you whole afternoons off? Well, well it's something like that. I do travel. I win. <laughs> but I'm kind of jealous. I'd love to be able to leave the island and visit far-off places. And I do sell my services. It's not as great as you'd think. I've seen plenty of things I'd rather forget. Really? 
Yeah. You don't know how lucky you are living on this island. I see. I suppose you might be right. Sorry. I guess I ruined the mood. Best not hang around out here much longer. We're staying at a tavern. Why don't you come there until this blows over? It's not too far from here. Who's we? Um, just a group of people I travel with. Really? I'd love to meet them. Lead the way. To the tavern you shall go. To the tavern we shall go. To the tavern we shall go. Hi ho the Zaleo, the tavern we shall go. <laughs> Zale, welcome back. We were just drinking. No shit. <laughs> no, remember, I went out to get them alcohol. Oh, yeah. That's right. They couldn't be drinking. Uh huh. What's this about then? Not bad. <laughs> Not bad at all. <laughs> something wrong? It's okay. I get it. No need to explain. No one's judging you here. Zale, I have to say. Well done, mate. <laughs> I guess this means he's taken after you now, Lowell. That's a pity. Yep, all my hard work's paid off. I'm so proud of the lad. So proud of him. It's not like that. Listen to me. Blah, 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 blah. This is happening. We ran away. And... Sounds like quite an adventure. Anyway. Now that's settled, time for a nice bath. Care to join me, Lisa? <laughs> You've been running around all day. You must be all hot and sweaty. Oh, well, yes. What? Seren? What? Is there a problem? Oh, you want to get in with us, don't you? <laughs> no, I, I mean, I'm not saying it wouldn't be nice, yeah, but... Oh What's Wait, the problem really getting bad. the bath with them? Mean, yes. I mean, no. <laughs> you can hear Lowell in the background going, What's the problem? Get in the bath with them! <laughs> Lisa, are you alright? Oh, yes. I've never been anywhere like this before. Everyone seems so full of life. Hey, lady. Bring us some more drink. Oh my. Am I getting popular? Uh, I think they're a little... confused. You go and join Saran. See you later, Sale. Why did that stop being voiced all of a sudden? Yeah. This game is. This game does that a lot. It, I've never seen a game handle voice acting the the way this game handles voice acting. It's bizarre. It is bizarre. Like I feel like I said five words, or, or maybe okay, more than that. But like I feel like I barely said anything. <laughs> Well, now's the time. Right, say all the words. Uh, running upstairs. <laughs> What's Oosh. in here? When I'm just watching his sleeping face like this, I always feel like I have to find some way to help him live a full and happy life. Maybe it's because he's so much younger than me, but I can't help doting on him. Yes, stop dotting. <laughs> uh, Do you need something? Um, no, not really. Then leave me alone. I'm not in the mood for idle chit chat. Okay. Jeez. Chapter 5 is literally just in this pub. <laughs> they should have made the whole chase sequence Chapter 5. I can hear people laughing and splashing water around. The bath must be in this room. Self-control. My, my little Lisa. You're more well endowed than I thought. I... I'm sorry? Why are we hiding all this? Come on. Let me touch him. <gasps> Seren! Oh man, this feels good. Uh, hey, why are you so interested in these anyway? What? Who wouldn't go crazy? 
for these lovely rolls of cash. <laughs> <laughs> Who's there? Why, Sale? You lil! Ah, get out of here, you big perv! No, I... I didn't mean to... Ow! <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna work. I <laughs> got it up too late. <laughs> too late. <laughs> uh, this is gonna work. I got it up too late. Have you spoken to Marania and Lowell? It sounds like there might be a spot of trouble. You should go and see them. What's wrong? You both look miserable. Oh, that's right. I actually have to press A. There's this boy, Warren. The guy who owns the place took him in. He's a good kid. But he appears to have something of a rare illness. He needs a particular medicine. We've been searching tirelessly for it, but we've yet to find any. So that's why you were gone yesterday. Have you got any kind of lead? Sort of. We spoke to a trader who deals in it. But he said he got attacked by bandits and they took his whole supply. Where's the kid now? He's sleeping upstairs. Back upstairs! They're talking about this dude. Well, yeah, who else were they going to be talking about? <laughs> oh, hello, Zale. I spoke to Lowell and Marania. I had to come and visit Warren. Cheers. He never gets to talk to anyone but me and Dad. He'll be so happy. You're a mercenary, aren't you? Yep. That's so amazing. I want to be a mercenary too when I grow up, but I guess I can't. I'm too sick. Trust me, kid, it's a shitty job where no one is grateful and everyone's afraid of you because you're a mercenary. Yeah. No. You'll get better. And then you'll be the strongest mercenary there ever was. Just you wait and see. I don't have the heart to tell him. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, you must have been to tons of different places. Next time, you'll have to tell me all about them. Any time, Warren. Zale, thank you. Ah, oh, here's like Radiata. Tell me your tales! Like that sick kid in Radiata's story! We found the medicine. Really? Yeah, but there's a catch. It's apparently been hidden in the warehouse the bandits use. That medicine's worth a lot. Those rotten bandits are looking to make a tidy profit. That's despicable. So we've been talking about how to get it off them. We can't simply ask them and expect that they'll give it to us. Which is why we're mounting a break-in. We're going to burst into that bandit's hideout. You all ready? Let's go! So we're back to splitting a single about hour-long recording into multiple episodes for this series. That's probably going to end up being the norm, given both how I record these and how I want to put out content. Anyways, see you the next time.